Okay, so it's been raining, and I decided to go check out the backyard because we usually get really big puddles. I think I accidentally scared away a fairy. Uh, there's a little boat here with some, a little basket, some mushroom, uh oh, some flowers. That's nice. And then over there, this showed up last night. It looks like a little building, hard in the shadow. Might be a little boathouse and a little tent with some flappy leaves. Uh, but yeah, I think I might have fairies in my backyard. Let's talk about fairies because I really didn't know much about them until a couple of days ago. While there are dozens of types of fairies, the two that I've heard the most about are F-A-E-R-I-E-S and F-A-I-R-I-E-S. Both are mischievous, but the fairies are best left alone. Now, fairy safety rule number one, never give any fairies or fae your name, because names hold power and they could use that power to control you. I've also read that you should never thank a fairy because they believe it dilutes their act of kindness or that you'll forget the good deed they did for you. I wanted to introduce myself to them, so I'm gathering little tokens I think they'll appreciate. Their boat's been abandoned, but I'm really hoping they'll come back and see what I've left for them. The uh, coin and flower ring are donated by my niece and nephew, and there's also berries, flowers, and a sprig of lavender. Wish me luck! Today's fairy find is a little bit harder to get to, but it's one of my favorites so far. You just need to get through some of these weeds. And then right down in here, I found a tiny fairy swing. It looks like they've used vines as ropes. And then right behind it, looks like a tiny fairy path, probably leading to some of their houses. I'm really jealous, that swing looks really fun, but I'm a bit too big to use it. <laughs> Guys, guys, I think it finally happened. I went to go get my cookie plate back, and instead I found it out here in the grass filled with these adorable little things. Looks like there's a bunch of berries in my little teacup that I left, and it's almost like a little flower crown of sorts. Look at that. That's so cute. Now, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to accept these or not yet, so I'm gonna do more research. I think I just got my first fairy gift. It's been raining a lot the last couple days, so I've had to stay inside. But it looks like the fairies have been having a pretty good time outside. I found a tiny tea party. They used some of the mugs and the teapot that I gave them. It's like somebody took a big bite out of that berry. And I got a little flower and a vase. It's so precious. And then they put all of this underneath a little tent made out of leaves and sticks. That way they'd stay dry. It's so cute. I should buy more miniatures for them. This is really fun. 